Welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Okay, I've just watched Lennon's video and she spoke about using the Wheel of Fortune as the sort of like the spread layout, so to speak, in the way she did this. Now, just, just give me a second. Okay, she did her video on progress using the tarot. Sorry, and and I can understand exactly um, where she's coming from, being where, you, where she is and all that sort of stuff. Now, I'm in New Zealand, so things may be a little bit different, and we're talking about change and everything that's going on in our world as such. But I also thought this would be a really good spread to really look at our own beliefs, our own thoughts about, um, what's going on in the situation. So I'm using the Waterfall Tarot. Now the Waterfall Tarot is um, from Tarot Oracle and you can get it from his Etsy shop, etc. The Tarot Oracle Etsy shop. So anyway, so what I want to do is get back to looking at the change and the progress and everything that's happening in my own world in a in a new way, a new perspective, a fresh perspective, so to speak. I'm not just talking about what's happening around outside, but but what I can do, what my where I'm at personally. So the first card, the first card we're looking at here is at the top, and it says what is sitting at the top. So if you really want to get back to what um, what the original video is about, I will put the link down below so you can see that. But this is definitely a um, definitely a video that you have to watch of the Lennon. So anyway, let's get back to what is sitting at the top. So I'm talking about myself. What is sitting at the top? Okay, so let's have a look. Whoops. Here we go. For me, the six, six of pentacles. So to me, it's about give, you know, giving to charity, giving with, you know, unconditionally, without expecting anything, anything. So what is moving away? I'm going to try and think which way this actually goes. This side here. Or oh, which is this this side. Oh, I'm doing it the other way. I'm trying to get... I'm, when I'm doing something upside down, it is a bit tricky, isn't it? So what is moving away? Oh, the way we look at things. To me, this is about the way I see things. Maybe the need to sacrifice myself. What is actually getting crushed at this time? Ooh. What is getting crushed? Maybe hope and dreams, um, the possibilities of seeing the light out of the darkness. Maybe it's what I feel is crushed. Interesting, really interesting. So what is moving up? So what's moving up? Ah, things in moderation, emotions, maybe things feeling like they're sort of coming together in some way, blending together. Interesting. So how can I decenter myself without disappearing? This is what fascinates me, I think. How can I decenter myself without disappearing? If everything that's going on in the world, in whatever it is, and what's you know with with everything and then what's happening in New Zealand um, with different aspects as well that's something that really um, affects within all of us um, so there's a lot of aspects I'm not going to go get too political about it um, but there is a lot of stuff happening in New Zealand that is quite political um, that affects each of us personally on many levels um, even 
it's very hard to describe and I just don't want to get into too, too much detail about what's actually going on but um, for me personally um, and the way I feel about things is very personal um, for many reasons but anyway let's go how can I just think to myself without just disappearing and that means sort of like not getting because I'm not of that ethnicity I'm not of that culture so Wow, taking the lead from others, very strong, it's about taking the lead from others, not trying to, not trying to lead in this way, I'm getting a sense of not trying to lead, but being led by others, I think is quite important in this process, I think there are more people that are more experts in this area, or more connected to what's going on, so I need to be led by them, in that way oh that is a really powerful spread definitely recommend that you go and check out the original video um, about with this with lemon I think it's absolutely brilliant she, um, her explanation and her videos uh, this is a really big shout out to lemon um, if you haven't actually watched any of her videos they are very informative thought-provoking I they're always on my watch list when I get around to watching them. And I just love, I love, love, love the channel. So this is someone who's very authentic in their, um, in the way that they come across within themselves. And I, I love that. And this is why I can totally recommend a channel with them when you want to sort of further your tarot study, you want to explore new avenues with tarot, um, you want to think about things that are a little bit outside of the square, outside of the box, so to speak, this is the channel to go to. So this is my big shout out for today. Um, but this is a, a great spread. Oh my God, this is so much. I'm going to add to my tarot journal as well, because I really want to sort of look at this in, in a different way. I will put in um, Tarot Oracle's Etsy shop that you can order the deck. I don't know how many he's got left, because I know that they went quite quickly, they're a little bit thicker than this in their card stock, um, comes, does come in a top tuck box, which is, but it is beautifully done, tuck box, um, it is gorgeous, so anyway, that's it from me, don't forget to check the links below, check the links on my channel, like, subscribe, and ring that bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded, take care, and blessed be.